How rich is Damar de Rosen? Well, Damar de Rosen is worth more than $90 million, and that was after he got drafted into the NBA. You might remember de Rosen for being the face of the Toronto Raptors, or the time he threw the hammer down on Tristan Kardashian. Born in California, Damar Darnell de Rosen grew up in the mean streets of Compton. As early as ever, he fell in love with the sport of basketball, and developed quite an athletic edge among his peers. During DeMar's early teenage years, he spent much of his time honing his skills on the court, which ultimately sheltered him away from the organized crime in Los Angeles. Remarkably before the age of 13, he was already dunking over his father and had a reputation around the tough neighborhood as a future star. DeMar DeRozan attended Compton High in California, where he quickly became one of the nation's top players. As a freshman playing with the big boys, he averaged 26 points per contest, along with 8 rebounds. Due to his sheer athleticism and the ability to furiously attack the basket, DeMar DeRozan soon became a crowd favorite. While playing varsity basketball all four years, he helped his team secure a back-to-back, -back Moore League championship. As a senior DeRozan averaged 29 points per contest, and led Compton High to a 26-win season, which ultimately helped him make the highly coveted All-American team. Following graduation DeMar went to the University of Southern California, to play for the Trojans. As a freshman making his collegiate debut, he dropped team high 21 points and astonishingly started in every single game of the season. He even managed to score in double figures on 28 different occasions, helping the Trojans reach the second round of the NCAA tournament, but they were no match for the runner-up Michigan State. After just a single academic year, in 2009 DeMar decided to forego his final three years of studies in order to play in the NBA. With the ninth pick in the 2009 NBA draft, the Toronto Raptors selected DeMar DeRozan for $4.7 million. During his first year in the league, he averaged only nine points per contest, but his ability to dunk made him a standout amongst others. The following season, as the Raptors' top star departed from the city, the franchise desperately looked for a future team leader. DeMar DeRozan rose to the challenge, and increased his average to 17 points per contest, but they were no match for other NBA contenders, resulting in the Raptors finishing the season with only 22 victories and 60 losses. In 2010 he made his debut appearance in the Sprite Slam Dunk competition. Although many spectators felt DeMar was the clear winner, he unfortunately finished in second place. The following season, DeMar DeRozan returned to the All-Star Weekend, but could not capitalize in the slam dunk competition. In 2013 his on-the-court performance changed significantly, as he improved his defense and the ability to shoot the ball resulting in DeMar averaging 21 points per contest, and signing a contract extension worth $39 million. 2014 turned out to be an incredible year for DeRozan. He not only became the fourth NBA All-Star in franchise history, but helped the Raptors secure 48 victories and a third seed position in the Eastern Conference. During the same season, DeMar led his team to the NBA playoffs for the very first time in six years. The Raptors faced Brooklyn in a tough seven-game series, even though DeMar became the first player in franchise history to drop 30-plus points back-to-back -back in the postseason. The Raptors unfortunately were eliminated due to the failure of converting the very last possession of the ball game. In 2015 DeMar upped his average to 22 points per contest, and led his team to the NBA playoffs for the second time in two years. Sadly the Toronto Raptors were no match for Washington who swept them in four games.
Unfazed by failure, Damar continued to rally alongside his team, helping the Raptors achieve a historic record of 56 victories. In 2016 as Toronto entered the playoffs for the third straight year, Damar dropped 30 points to help them win their first postseason series. In Round 2 Toronto sent Miami home in seven games which resulted in the Raptors earning a trip to the Eastern Conference Finals for the very first time in over 15 years. Although DeMar dropped 20-plus points in every single game, the Raptors tasted defeat at the hands of the Cavaliers. Following the postseason, DeMar signed a five-year contract extension worth $140 million, bumping his yearly salary to $27 million. At the moment DeMar is averaging 27 points per contest, and is well on his way to capturing his first ever NBA championship. Currently DeMar DeRozan lives in Toronto, Canada, and also owns a $4 million estate in California. Just a fun fact. DeMar DeRozan and I have been friends for years. We first met during gym class at Compton High and haven't stopped kicking it since. When he got drafted it was none other than your boy Alfred, who threw the biggest party in Beverly Hills, because Damar and I have been in the trenches together. In conclusion Damar DeRozan is making more money, fucking more bitches, and dunking on more people than you and I combined. Don't forget to subscribe for more because Damar and I are kicking it after game 6. Just a message to all my viewers, please, when you get a chance, visit the How Rich Are They store, your boy Alfred created some lit as fuck t-shirts, and you can find them in the description of this video. I just wanna get that money, I just wanna get that money, flip that money, I just wanna stack them hundreds.